Um, is a 5.5 A1C after six months on carnivore too high? Could this mean I'm eating too much protein? Where was it six months ago? That's the first thing, because it's always good about to look at trends. Secondly, what was your average blood glucose on your continual glucose monitor or on your uh, capillary testing, which is when you know when you do your finger pricking, because the A1C is notoriously unreliable um, because it's factor into other things like the life of your red blood cells. 5.5, no, I don't think that's particularly high. I would be very interested in your actual average blood glucose from, from your daily readings. That would be the thing that I would uh, be, be going by, to be honest. Could, could this mean I'm eating too much protein? Look, I really think that there's, it's very difficult to eat too much protein. Um, protein is the one thing that we shouldn't fear. I think it's um, it's it's incredibly important to make sure we're consuming enough. And most people on a keto carnivore lifestyle or, or keto and even carnivore um, don't consume enough protein. Glycation is glucose sticking to proteins, not the other way around. Uh, and those that think, you know, uh, dietary protein turns into glucose, that, that just doesn't happen. Steak doesn't become cake. None of the protein turned into glucose. 